Hey guys, I'm here with Chris at Chicago in the ABC's conference. Chris, can you introduce yourself to the people in uh, UK and USA? Of course. With your services, your company and your background? Yeah, of course. So my name's Chris Negus. I'm the managing partner of Global NRG Advisory Limited and LLC. We have an office in London and in New York. And we are the world's premier financial advisors into the RNG sector globally. Perfect. How busy are you at the minute with the US market, oh. uh, taking into account where the USA's biogas market is now? Yeah, certainly. So for us, it's been an incredibly busy couple of days, and we're only just beginning here in Chicago, obviously. Uh, we're seeing incredible amount of growth, talking to developers, technology providers, and the oil and gas industry about decarbonizing their requirements over the next couple of years. So it's a, it's a great place to be, a great opportunity. How do you see the market growing? Is it rapid or it's kind of slow, it's, slower moving? It's incredible rapid growth. If I take it in the last year from when I was in Las Vegas at the American Biogas Council event, it's doubled in size. You're just seeing more and more big players coming into this space. So it's a fantastic opportunity for growth and rapid growth at that. Is there any numbers of projects you heard going to be um, built within the next one or two years? Yeah, certainly. So I've heard numbers of sort of 15, 20 projects a year for the next couple of years, which massively outgrows the European markets and really just highlights the opportunities that are, that are over this side of the pond. How long is your expertise in the, in the industry of biogas? Yeah, so I've been in the industry for the last six years. I've been focusing on the US market for the last four. Um, so really understand sort of the LCFS, the RINs, but actually how the projects are put together as well. I did over 175 million pro uh, pounds worth of projects in the UK oh, market. So uh, really understanding the technological aspects of it as well as the financial. Is it the only state you're working with or is uh, any other parts of America? So we're working right across the US, uh, Canada, into Latin America and Australia as well. So truly a sort of global company and, and industry at the moment for us. Is there any specific challenges you face on the, uh, in, in the USA market? Uh, the principal challenge over here is the cost of the materials especially things like concrete and that's where we're seeing some real challenges on the IRRs for investors but you know there's creative ways of doing it one massive uh, difference to the European markets is not having to pay for digestate to be taken away it's seen as a product so therefore it's an increased revenue stream and that really helps mitigate some of those increased costs on the on the materials are you the the the, the man for the developers are, or, or the farmers directly can approach your services and ask for your help? Yeah, so farmers directly can approach us as well. Uh, one service that we do is develop projects to then sell on to the big funds and the oil giants. So we can speak directly to a food producer or a farmer that's just wanting to get rid of waste and not necessarily own the project themselves. Where are you better than anybody else uh, in the market? I think it's the broad scope of services that the team offers. So we've got environmental lawyers, we've got waste management experts, but we've also got investment banking background. So we can do the full service from negotiating their feedstock contracts to negotiating their off-take contracts with the oil and gas people to modelling to sourcing debt equity anywhere in the globe. And we are the only company that offers that truly global approach. I appreciate your time, Chris. Um, I'm looking forward to see you on our podcast. Yes, um, I hope you enjoy your time in Chicago. Uh, ABC makes us think that the America's market is going to go really, really high. It will indeed. And uh, all I'll say is keep your eyes peeled. There'll be some exciting announcements from us in the next couple of months. Brilliant. Thank you very Excellent. much for your time. Thank you.